What is up guys this is Kiran here and welcome back to another episode of Android 11 based custom rooms which are available for Redmi Note 8 users if you are a Redmi Note 8 user right now we have 3 4 or approximately 5 Android 11 based custom rooms available and one of them is Droid on Time which is .os if you are an old user in the terms of routing and custom rooms you already know about the .os i have previously used .os with Android 6 and Android 7 at that time dot os was also one of the cool rooms out there but then i didn't I didn't use even once this room and now we are back with dot os with android 11 which i've installed it on my redmi note 8 looks interesting by the way how is this working which other things you get here you get any features or not everything in this video i'm going to share with you so stay tuned for that and make sure to watch this video till the end let's get started Guys, first of all, let me tell you one thing that this room comes with the quick step launcher pre-installed and if you want to install the pixel launcher, I have just, I just made a video yesterday. You can go and check it out that how you can install pixel launcher this room. And let me tell you one thing that if you install pixel launcher and if you want to use this quick step launcher again unfortunately you cannot if i want to choose a quick step launcher that will not work as you can see it will look like this so i'm not going to use this quick step launcher as i wanted to use pixel launcher so that's why i've installed that so if you want to use the pixel launcher seriously just go for it and install this and then you'll not be able to use the quick step launcher pixel launcher is great in the terms of some features we had a lot of features out there we can use this launcher and I am using this also I've applied the pixel wallpaper from the pixel 5 and the link for this video and these wallpapers is also in the description you can go and check it out and if you go for AOSP apps, yes, it has AOSP apps like the messaging and dialer pad. I already have replaced some other things. It's fully based on AOSP, so it has all the AOSP features out there as expected. And if you want to customize your quick settings, you cannot do at all. If you go here and click here and if you go here you will not see any options to customize and you have the same android 11 kind of thing by two by three these kind of things two rows and three columns as expected also let me show you about the magisk manager if it is working or not Magisk Manager is perfectly working but only the modded version right now and let me note it the Magisk V20 1.0 is not working. I don't know why maybe we have to wait a little bit more for that but right now it's not working at all. And if you go for safety net status and want to check out how safety net unfortunately the safety net status is still not passed yet. Right now I'm using this modded Magisk on my Redmi Note 8 and Magisk I don't know why it's showing me safety net not passed. Maybe I have to hide the Magisk manager. We want to take a look at that later on. Let's move on to some things in settings. Let me show you one bug which I got till now. As you can see I have enabled the Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi is perfectly fine here and if I go for the Bluetooth one unfortunately the bluetooth is not working at all in the atom os the bluetooth was turning on but like the bluetooth media was not working but right now in dot os we have the bluetooth bug it will not work at all as you can see it's now disabled it's even not turning on so this is a bug this is a main and kind of a major bug for some users so bluetooth is not working if you can you, if you can use your device without bluetooth go for it and install this the room is perfectly fine here and also i didn't got any lags at all it's good and almost same like atom os but still i recommend you to use the atom os because that's perfectly fine here without even any major bugs at all till now little bit of bugs maybe because that's in very early stage a beta stage but still it's perfect for daily use till now Moving on to some things which you get here, when you go to the system option, you have no options to customize even your status bar. So not a single customization features at all or you can say it's same like the Lineage OS which has not a single feature. But yes, if you are a user who don't like the features, go for it and install that. So we have the power menu, we have the system navigation options where you can enable the suggestion navigation and you cannot hide these kind of things like the navigation bar pill if you want to hide you cannot hide that other things are kind of same thing as expected and if you go for the security app 
here we have the fingerprint option but no face lock available too yes no face lock and if you regularly use face lock then this room is not for you but if you're like me like i always don't use the face lock at all sometimes i use sometimes i don't use but it's not a main priority for me so that's why i will choose this room if i want to other things are kind of same sound storage etc if you go to the display we have the dark theme etc 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 kind of same thing and display cutout has almost same kind of things which you get in atom os also so nothing new here almost every kind of things are same talking about the battery backup honestly battery backup is very very interesting the battery drainage is no more overnight only zero percent yes zero percent not a single percent drain in approximately six to seven hours which is mind-blowing and overall the battery backup is perfectly fine here i'm using it from some time it's great so in the terms of battery backup i will recommend you to use droid on time which is dot os custom room based on android 11 other things are kind of the same Bluetooth is not working, other things are fine, go and install this build right now if you want to. I already shown the magic and almost other kind of things. If you want to install it, link is in the description, go and install this build right now on your Redmi Note 8 device if you want to. These were the things I just wanted to share with you, so thanks for watching, goodbye.